So whether you have long format content or not, uh, you can use long video to shorts. Let's go ahead and, and open it up and let's just see what's going on here. All right, so I could drop a video or I could just select the video to make it easy because all you're going to do is drop your long format content here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just click and show you guys what it generated. And these clips are a little too long for me. Uh, the best performing clips are going to be 15 to around 25 seconds. Um, just you got to think short, short attention span. Um, the quicker you get to the point, the better. Um, but these are good. It gives you, you know, the title, the description. You can edit it right here. You can click double and, and it will open everything up. You can natively post to TikTok and YouTube. But these are really good. I would just recommend um, maybe editing your covers. Um, I've already, let's see, this one. Yeah, this one I may have gave me a standard cover. I can mute my mic and we can watch some uh, minute and 43. We are not watching that. It's okay. Uh, but don't worry about that. This is a really easy way to put your longs and put it in here. Now, if you're having problems with the way it zooms up on your content, if you shot it um, more in a horizontal format, which is like how you view YouTube, you can click edit and then you can you can tap on the the timeline there and it will it will put it in like the one third of the phone screen in the middle it'll be smaller but then it won't eliminate any information from your video like at, like this shot or something so you can fix all that but it's a great way to generate like reels and it's going to pick out your best reels or what it thinks i have the best chance of going viral or it's just pure best value content uh so let's give you an example of a couple of these this one's short these are seven reasons why you need to start making passive income online right now and how to keep you motivated. So let's get into it. Stay towards them. The last one's going to blow your mind. Okay, that's great. That That is just a real good hook into long format content with shorts um, or TikToks, whatever. But, um, you know, that could be repurposed over on, you know, I could use that for, for LinkedIn, Facebook and Instagram reels, TikTok, YouTube shorts. Um, you name it. I could. That's short enough. I could drop that on all my stories if I wanted to. I'm just saying. Um, so use this as your tool, as a weapon. I'm just trying to make this really good, really impactful uh, for you to find this. Just want to provide as much updates as possible. So, um, yeah, the long, long video to short and script to video. Uh, my other tool that I've noticed does a little bit better is Descript, Descript.com. That's D-E-S script, like just Descript, D-E script.com. Uh, it is paid. They do have a trial version you can check out. Um, I wouldn't worry too much about the captions in, in Descript is not as good as, let's just say, editing out redundancies, editing out repeated words, ums, uhs, but also CapCut does have a cut filler option. Remove filler words. Uh, okay, captions. Is it under captions? Identify filler words. Okay, so now, okay, it was free cap cuts. Now, okay, it's gen okay. I got two uses left though, so it looks like I could do it. So you might be able to do it for free, but um, check it out, see how it works. But also compare it to Descript because as of right now, Descript's AI um, cuts out redundancies. Um, it cuts out stuff that doesn't lead to a conclusion, um, st repeated stuff, and it identifies really well. And then it's got a meter of low, strong, and high on Descript. I'm not really trying to, you know, get you guys on Descript. I'm just saying it's got a free option um, just in case you feel like you want to save time cutting those little gaps out in your audio or those ums and ahs. Um, so this has just been another really good cap cut.